everyone, I'm meteorologist David Jones. Hope you had a great weekend. What does the wind at Race Rocks off Victoria have to do with the end of the heat wave? Well, here's the story. The satellite imagery shows change in the weather approaching from the south. A swirling low off the Oregon coast is creeping northward, spreading thicker bands of cloud cover toward the Fraser Valley. But the wind has shifted to west and strengthened in the Strait of Juan de Fuca. Note the change at the bottom of the screen at 5 a.m. this morning. That shift and increase means the cooler marine air is now pouring through the strait and will reach the valley tonight. You'll know it. Zooming into the radar, you can see the bands of showers sweeping northwest. It will be a few hours before the rain reaches the valley, roughly near midnight, so we're going to squeeze another superb evening out of the warm pattern before it cracks completely overnight. The inflow will strengthen as the evening progresses with gusts anywhere from 20 to 50 kph as the cooler marine air floods up the valley. But the winds go light overnight and remain that way on Tuesday. After another lovely evening, the rain will begin about midnight. Tonight's min temps 8 to 12. Tomorrow, showers or afternoon thunder showers and much cooler with highs to 18. The MOFO precip forecast suggests a wide range of rainfalls between 5 and 30 millimeters, which you expect with showers and embedded thunder showers. There might be some gusty winds under those thunder showers as well. In the longer range or the medium range, cool, cloudy, and occasional showers expected Wednesday and Thursday, with another rainstorm arriving Friday night. Have a great last evening.